And just on your forum post, you're having trouble mapping these remix decks. You're saying you can't actually click on the individual slots. And I think I managed to replicate that for you. So if I go ahead and start Tractor, wait a second for that to load. Now, what I've currently got connected is just my F1, um, which hopefully should look a lot similar to your machine. Um, if I go to my controller manager, and that machine mapper you're using is using the legacy controls, I assume, because it's an older mapping. So if you look under the types of controls in a remix deck, if I go to legacy and just as an example, slot trigger play, I can go learn a button and that's pressing a button on the F1 and pad one assignment. But what you're having a problem with is here, remix deck and slot one. And it seems that you can't select any of these slots except if you go down the bottom because the menu actually expands far enough. The little trick I found was to make the controller manager window bigger. At least on Mac this works. And now you'll actually be able to control the individual slots. Now, that's the old way of working with the sample decks, not so much the remix decks, and that's for legacy mappings like yours. It may be better to dig a lot deeper into the new methods, such as the direct mapping, slot one, so one, two, three, and four triggers, and so on. These are the newer ways of interfacing with the remix deck. All right, man, hopefully that helps you.